Hello, Dr. Wilson One here, and welcome to second episode of the Goons Cast podcast. Today, I have with me Kai. Hello. And our special guest for this week, Daniel. Hello. Hey. What's going on? Not much. What are we doing this week, Will? Well, let's see. This week we're going to be doing WikiHow. Or, so no. we're doing a bit of a a bit of a game show style thing. We're gonna be um, Will and Daniel are gonna be competing uh, to win the most rounds of this game show that I have stolen off of another comedy podcast. Uh, plagiarism as it at its finest. Yes. Or, or um, until I just break down. Yeah, that that too. That too. Oh yeah. Uh, in the Nuzlocke, I believe we are on our way to the fire gym. I don't think we're leveled there yet. I think it's level twenty nine. Is that twenty nine? Okay. Yeah. So we're basically just in the uh, grinding again. But uh, happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Oh yeah, that happened. Yeah, <laughs> it did happen. It did. It did indeed. Um, it was a day, and uh, yeah, food was had. <laughs> Apparently, Will did not participate, or he was just blacked out, just eating. It's fine. Yeah. Well, I, that's essentially what this giving is. Yeah. Yeah. Basically. Oh. You just black out, open your stomach, and take a nap afterwards for three days yeah <laughs> i mean that, that's what everybody does yeah honestly i'm looking up the fire gym and pokemon sapphire real quick so we can uh, make sure that we're getting to the right level uh level 28 is the highest what are we currently at 28 okay yeah our highest is 26 Okay. Oh, by the way, am I allowed to look things up? Um, no. Once we, I will, I will explain the, I will explain the whole thing in a second. Lame. <laughs> um, <laughs> so yeah, well, we're pretty much just gonna be need to kill some more zigzagoons. Keep an eye out for a shiny, cause I really do want a shiny. <laughs> but, no one uh, our yeah, chances. Just, just gonna back, be a zigzagoon. Just get back to playing them. Yes. Um, well, this breakdown might happen sooner than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, um, real quick, thank you everybody for the uh, for the subscriptions. We are now at 103. Which reminds which is me, amazing. Next week, me and Kai will be unboxing this on camera with another guest star who's actually been doing all of our art for us. Fusion. So he will be here, and we'll be unboxing Chilling Rain, and just kind of have an all-around good time. We won't be doing any uh, Pokemon Nuzlocke. It'll all be just us in person. So I, uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. Should be fun. Should be fun. Hey, yo, I'm down to join if uh, y'all don't mind. Well, that might be fun. Yeah. The more the merrier. Yeah. All right. So here, um, here's uh, what we're gonna be doing today. We're gonna be playing a game called Wiki What. Uh, the way it goes is I will be um, reading from a wiki how, and I will be leaving out the important parts of what that wiki how is trying to teach you how to do. Oh, no. So, I will be reading sections of said WikiHow, and your guys' job will be to guess what it is. Okay. Um, <clears throat> we're going to be doing a best of five, unless the rounds take ridiculously long. Uh, if you get it within a reasonable margin of error, I will give it to you. And, uh... Yeah, it's best of five. Hey. 
this. Uh, you are not allowed to look up any um, instructions on how to, uh, on like uh, what I could be looking up. So no research on your own. I got a mute button. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, if I su suspect cheating, we will just restart the round. Literally, it's if I don't mute my mic. My keyboard is not quiet. Um, have you not heard my? Have you not heard my? I said I sat down <laughs> in the room the other day while we opened a booster box, and that uh, thing like he started typing and I jumped. <laughs> <laughs> There's a reason you can hear it on stream. Yeah, like it's incredibly round. All right, so we're gonna be starting our first round here in a minute. Um, this one, it, it's, it's pretty specific. <laughs> it's, okay. it's gonna be, it's gonna be a little difficult, I think. Okay. All right. Method one. Use a long weapon. If you are forced to defend yourself against said enemy, avoid close quarters combat. Keep as far out of reach of its legs as you can since these kick can kick hard enough to kill a lion. Use the nearest, longest object that could be used as a weapon, such as a pole, rake, or broom. Defending Any yourself. Guesses? Any guesses, gentlemen? And this is Pokemon? No, no, these aren't <laughs> oh. Pokemon related. Oh, I was like, I was like, this is, <laughs> what? Uh, I was really confused and concerned. Defending against a horse? No. Any guesses, Daniel? I'm gonna think. Just it's throw him out, just throw him out. You said its kick is powerful enough to kill a lion? Keep as far out of reach of its legs <clears throat> as you can, since these can kick hard enough to kill a lion. Kangaroo? What about a kangaroo? Oh, defending against- <laughs> my bad. Defending against a kangaroo? No. Uh. If you have a gun and need to use it, aim for the enemy's main body to better ensure hitting your target. Although they will be attacking with their legs and or beak, their legs and neck are very thin and easy to miss. Defending against a seagull? No. Why would a seagull kick? <laughs> now, I'm, now I'm concerned as to what you got in your head right now. How would a seagull <laughs> kick hard enough to kill a lion? What, yeah, what I don't know. Have you encountered <laughs> none. <laughs> Man-eating seagulls out here will not have good <laughs> beach trips. Oh, it's okay if we have our own personal nightmares. <laughs> oh. oh Alright, Will is terrified of seagulls. Okay, that's a new one. Um, I've never heard of that that specific fear, that's an interesting one. <laughs> um, what about defending against a squid? Don't get too latched on to any one specific phrasing, like defending against. Okay. It is not defending against. Running away. From a squid. It's not squid. Damn. Let me go to the next portion. Keep to the side. Consider yourself at the most risk when the two of you are face to face. Remember that this enemy is only able to kick its legs directly in front of it. Stay behind or to the side of the bird as much as possible to keep clear of its most powerful weapon. Just, just the silence. Well, you have I, no idea what I'm talking about. Um, killing a penguin. Clue. Killing a penguin. It's not a penguin. It is Dang. a bird. Well, yeah, a penguin's a bird. Yes. That's why I'm, you're on the right track. It is a bird. Oh. I thought you were saying that in, like, 
No, it is a bird. Like, oh yeah, no. I know. I'm aware <laughs> penguins are birds. I was, uh, I was scared. I was scared for a second. This week on penguins, penguins has been wrong your entire life. Penguins are not, in fact, birds. Uh, man, my life's <laughs> life. This week on penguins unlimited. <laughs> Scientists have determined that penguins are not, in fact, birds. Oh, man. My life. My life is a lie. I have to... Along a, a, an extended relative of the woolly mammoth. Okay, that made my guesses even more few and far between. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. A dodo? Defending against... Or no, running away from a dodo? No. I don't think WikiHow's that old. All right, step three, aim for the neck. Consider this to be the enemy's weakest body part. Strike it where it is most vulnerable and least protected to defeat it more quickly. Failing that, aim for its breast. Concentrate your efforts between the two as the opportunity affords. Continue to strike it until it quits and runs away. This is a five-step method, and there, are, and there are three methods to do this how. Every single step made me more confused. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna reread the, the names of the steps. One, use a long weapon. Two, keep to the enemy's side. Three, aim for the neck. Huh. Keep throwing out guesses. I'll, I'll give you like hot and cold. I'll keep. I'll give you correct answers. Hummingbird. No. <laughs> this thing. This thing can kick hard enough to kill a lion. <laughs> okay. What birds interact with lions? Let's get to there. Start thinking about what birds are in that part of the world. Attacking a parrot? No, what? Would you find a parrot in the savannah? I don't know. <laughs> okay, um, these birds are very large. And very dangerous. Oh! Um, attacking an ostrich? It is an ostrich. Yeah, it's... It's not attacking one. Defending against ostrich. Alright. Step Gosh, four, damage its wings. If the ostrich refuses to give up despite your attacks to its neck, aim for its wings given the opportunity. Know that an ostrich uses its wings not for flight, but to alter course more smoothly when running, like just like a ship's runner. Damaging its wings may marginally improve your chances of running away in a zigzag fashion if you are forced to retreat. So is it running away from an ostrich? No. Oh, did he already say that? Yes. Defending right. against an ostrich. No. Step five <laughs> for its legs. If you find yourself to behind or to the side of an ostrich with an easy shot to one of its legs, take it. Know that the ostrich's center of gravity depends entirely on those two skinny legs. If given the chance, deliver one or both a blow to upset its balance, speed, and striking power. Hunting That's the last step an in ostrich this, in this method. Huh? Hunting an ostrich. No. All right, that's encountering the encountering an ostrich. There is encounter is in the title. You're getting closer. All right, I'm gonna move on to the next method. Evading a charging ostrich. Run for nearby cover. Expect ostriches to attain speeds of 43 miles an hour. Holy crap. Over open <laughs> ground. If there is dense vegetation or woods close enough for you to reach before the ostrich reaches you, sprint for that. Prevent the ostrich from attaining optimum speed so it has less chance of outrunning you. <laughs> <laughs> um, Somebody who wrote this is a legitimate article. Evading... 
evading an angry ostrich? No. Again, encounter is in the title. Or encounter, sorry. I meant to say encountering an angry ostr ostrich. I can't no. speak. Uh, encountering uh, an attack more... from an ostrich. Encountering an attack, no. Uh, if there is more sturdy cover than vegetation, such as a car or man-made structure, go for that. A kick from his ostrich's leg, jeez, I've said ostrich so many times, can hit you with an impact of 500 PSI, which is enough to kill a human. If you don't think you can make it, do not attempt it. Ostriches are extremely fast and will attack by kicking you in the back as soon as they catch up to you. Jeez, these things are brutal. Is ostrich in the title? Yes. Ostrich and encounter are in the title. Ostriching and, uh, and encounter. Ah, got it. <laughs> there are three main words, and then there are three connecting words. Six words? Yeah. Correct. And it, and of course, every, every answer will start with how to. Oh. Is it with you how? How to... How to survive an encounter with an ostrich. Word for word, Daniel's got it. Hey, let's go. That's such an interesting one. That's kind of random. It's one of the weirdest ones I came up with. the second one. It's Daniel 1, Will 0. Let's go. <clears throat> Part 1. Know that to obtain these, you need a special tool. You cannot obtain these with other implements, which means that you have to build the tool first. If you already have one of these tools and want tips on finding the material, skip to the next section. I thought someone was here and about to walk in the room. Um, and this is an animal. No. These are completely random. There is no pattern. Oh. Okay. The last round will have a pattern based on whoever's losing. Okay. What? Why? Why? What was the point of that? What was the point? That was the first step. That was the first no, step. No, I was. The cat just like <laughs> pushed on the hamper. And it's one of those like folding hampers. Oh, yeah. I think he was trying to use it to get in the little cat hammock that we have. Ah. Uh. Um. Alright, this one uh, has four words. And uh, only one of them is a connecting word. Wait. And then it starts with how to. That, that's not included. Okay. <clears throat> how to obtain gold? No. All right. Uh, well, your guess? How to harvest a mushroom. No. All right. Step two of part one. Create a workbench, if you haven't already. Oh, These so we're talking about, we're talking about uh, Minecraft. Okay. <laughs> All right, that's step two. Oh, that's the entire. Okay. Um. Harvesting wool? No. 
This one's gonna be difficult until we get to later sections. Your guess, Daniel? Move on then. Step three, create a wooden pickaxe. I swear to God, if this is Minecraft. <laughs> and then it gives you the crafting recipe. Oh my, oh my god! god. <laughs> oh my god. How to obtain wood in Minecraft. No. <laughs> oh. Hey, get off my computer. Uh uh. Uh uh. How to. The cat just fell off my computer. Make a. Cobblestone pickaxe. No. How to obtain diamond in Minecraft. Close. Can I guess a second oh. time? Nope, one guess per step. That's lame. <laughs> Alright, step four of part part one, create a stone pickaxe. How to harp pickaxe, dig four blocks down into the earth until you find smooth stone. Mine three stone while making sure that you have two sticks left over. And then in your crafting table, it tells you the crafting recipe. How to harvest iron. No. How to obtain a stone pickaxe in Minecraft. No. Gosh, dang it. It ends in in Minecraft, so you have that portion correct. <laughs> Alright. Step five of part one. Oh. Build or find a furnace. For your next step, you'll need a furnace. Furnaces can be found in villages or be made using eight cobblestone lined around the edges of your crafting table. How to obtain iron pickaxe in Minecraft? No. It's uh, it's uh, four words. Remember, it starts with how to. How to. Four words adds in in Minecraft. How to obtain iron. In Minecraft. No. Alright. Step six of part one. Build an iron pickaxe. With your stone pickaxe, start searching for iron ore. Iron ore can be found above ground and in caves. You only need to mine three. In your furnace, smelt together iron and coal to create an iron ingot. Alternatively, craft a block of iron and dot nine iron. How and then I'm also gonna I'm also just gonna I'm also just gonna read step seven. Make an iron pickaxe. Did you hear me? Yeah. What did you how say? Get, I said how to get diamonds in Minecraft. Ooh, so close. Well. How to obtain diamonds in Minecraft. Close again. I was about to say, I swear if that gets it, that doesn't <laughs> Part two, mining for diamonds. Before you, <gasps> wait, 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 wait. No. Step. Before you start, know that diamonds can be sometimes found above ground in naturally generated chests. These can be found in villages or mine shafts. Although it's possible to find diamonds without mining them, it's generally less successful. It is recommended to mine for them if you want to collect them efficiently. Did I already say how to mine diamonds? No, but that is not it. Gosh, dang it, does that count as my guess? Yep. That's lame. <laughs> How to Your obtain obsidian in Minecraft? No. Does it have diamond in the name? Yes. Alright. Step two of part two. Make sure you have adequate supplies before you go diamond mining. Your mission is to get diamonds, but in order to realize that mission, you first need some supplies. Be prepared with the following when you dig underground. Lots of torches, food, an iron or diamond pickaxe if you have one, uh, and then weapons and armor in case there are mobs. How to find diamonds on Minecraft. I'm gonna give it to you. Uh, it was in Minecraft, but you said on Minecraft. I did? Yeah. <laughs> oh. But that's it. <laughs> okay, it's t it's 2 nothing right now. Daniel is crushing it. Let's go. Cool. Alright, Will, you get to pick the topic of this third <laughs> round, since you are currently losing. Give me a general area. 
Mathematics. Oh, uh, this Mathematics. isn't fair. <laughs> this isn't fair. Oh, please don't be calculus. Hmm. All right, Will. Hey, this round is me, probably just going to go straight to you. You got to give me a second to come up with an interesting <laughs> one. Um, side note, after this, did you guys want to play some Minecraft? <laughs> <laughs> I might. <laughs> yeah, actually, I'd be fine with that. Uh, my question is, do I have Minecraft installed? Probably not. <laughs> Get that installing while we're doing this. I have both, actually. I've got the, it's nice, I've got that Google Fiber 2 gig up and down, or er, 2 gig download and 1 gig up. It's nice. I have, um, uh... Uh, Xbox Game Pass for the PC. I now have Microsoft Bedrock Edition and Java Edition, even though I only paid for Java once, and now I get oh. both free. Oh man! But of course, I had I've had Minecraft for over eight years, so yeah. Fair. Best game of all time. Mm. Oh, that reminds me. Next Tuesday. We'll be, we'll be doing a sh probably shorter-ish stream for the new 1.18 Minecraft update. We will be doing a survival. Yes. World. Yeah, we will be starting a Minecraft uh, playthrough. Yes. All right. So keep an eye out for that. That'll be wait, awesome. Wait, wait, wait. question. <clears throat> Are y'all playing Bedrock or uh, Java? Java. I have, I have an X, so I play Bedrock. Oh, okay. Wait, you have a Series X? Yeah. What? It just reminded me of you. It just reminded me of your PS5, and I said the same thing to him. Yeah, yeah. I was like, I can't really talk because I have the the PS5 disc. Yeah. Uh. All right. I I've been looking for this, but I can't. Okay. Um. I've been looking for specific ones, but I can't quite find them. So I'm just gonna. Okay. Uh. Before you start, do you know if I've caught Pokemon on Route 111, north of Mobville? Um, let's look it up. Pokemon on Route 101. Well, have I, like, you know, caught one? I know I caught oh, have one. You caught one there? Yeah. Um, where, I, where, where, what is it next to? It's next to Mauville, which is what I'm currently at. Mauville. Probably not. I've, I know I've caught one on Route 117, which is to the east. Or, sorry, west of Mauville, but I don't think I've got anyone oh, no, north. I don't think I don't think we've gone north of Mauville, so no. Okay, then I'll have to catch the next one I see. Okay. I don't know if we don't want to find that. Uh, looks like you can find. Ooh, a trap inch. If you go in the deep sand, you can find a trap inch. Which evolves into a Vibrava, which is a dragon and ground type. Oh. <clears throat> that thing is goaded, dude. You can also find a Sand True, which isn't as good, but still good. Yeah. Alright. Uh. I just right, grabbed I got my. It, I, got it, I, got it. I just grabbed my fucking controller, turned on my PlayStation, and then set it down, back down on the bed. Nice. <laughs> All right, here is uh, method one for this one. It is five words, two connectors, and it starts with how to. Mm -hmm. And how is, to technically math, included. It is, in, it is in math. It is math related. All right, method one: using technology. Step one, program your calculator. Oh my god. Write a program the day before the test. How to cheat at a test in math. You're very close. <laughs> <laughs> You're like right on top of it. Word it differently, Daniel. See if you can get it. <laughs> <laughs> How to cheat on a test in math class? 
Oh my gosh, you guys are just wording it so awkwardly. <laughs> that's that's not it. All right. Don't poison me. Step two: send a text via your smartphone to a friend. That's Say it. it again. I'm sorry. Okay. Send a text via your smartphone to a friend. That is the that is all that is in that step. All right, reword it, gentlemen. Let's see. How to accuse someone of cheating on a test in math. No. Will, you basically had it. Just dang it. How to cheat during a math exam. Nope. Daniel was, like, right on top of it, but he just kept talking. <laughs> he, he, you added, like, three extra words. All right. How to wait? No, you already guessed. You already guessed. <laughs> That's three. Send a text via your smartphone to a tutoring service. This the this method is using technology, by the way. Guesses, gentlemen. <laughs> This doesn't count as my guess, but does it include in, in math? Um, words that you guys have used that are in this are cheat, math, and test. How to cheat on a math test. Bam. They got it. <laughs> that was what I said the first time! <laughs> Alright, do you want to do an all, for noth all or nothing? I pretty much got all of them. Um, so I'm willing to take this bet. Yeah. <laughs> well. Oh yeah, I'll waste all of my zero. These are hilarious. All right. Co-authored by the WikiHow staff. That is hilarious. All right. Oh no. This one has um, three words, no connectors. Once again, I will only accept answers that start with how to. Does how to are those included? No. In that? Okay, I figured. All right. This, this is for everything, gentlemen. And just know, if I refuse to play Minecraft after this, you'll know why. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot I bought a monster earlier. <clears throat> Sorry, I went to my kitchen. I heard that through my earbuds, which are on the ground right now. Yes. <laughs> All right, um, method one. <laughs> Ignoring strangers in public. Walk away. How to be anti -social. Anytime, anytime you encounter rude or annoying behavior, you have the option of simply walking away from the person. While it's not always possible to get away from someone, it does work in many situations. Right, guesses. Sorry. <laughs> um, <laughs> sorry, my girlfriend's mom walked in and uh, was like, "I'm taking a shower." All right. She closed our door. But okay. <laughs> All right, guesses. Guesses. Throw them at me. You said how many words? Uh, it is three words. No connectors. Hmm. 
How to quick. avoid social interaction? Uh, no. Gosh, deadly dang it. Hey, Will, what's what's the status on our uh, level grinding here? Um, I accidentally walked into this family, and there's there's a literal six family, and I almost lost. Uh, uh, I forgot what he called him. Uh, <laughs> um, rubber duck. I. He's down to like. Is... He's down to like twenty three health. Nice. I'm very confused. Well, so over here. Pokemon, but like, is it a modded version of Pokemon? I'm just no, using an emulator. Oh. Because like. Oh yeah. I have it for my like I have the cartridge, but I just don't have. A Game Boy. Oh. I well. I can play it on my DS, but I just don't have a DS, um, like, to way I can stream it. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, you can play it on your DS, but you need a DS. Got it. <laughs> um, alright. Step two, go a different route. If you find you often run into the same person in public, Try to avoid them by going a different way. You may also be able to avoid them by going through the area slightly earlier or later. I don't think, dude, I don't think Will guessed. You don't think who asked? No, I... <laughs> I'm like, wow, I we're playing a game here. <laughs> no, I said, I don't think, I don't think Will guessed. Ah, uh, oh. Well, you get two guesses this time, Will. Okay. Okay, um, one question. Um, how do you destroy the rocks? Is it smash? Oh, uh, yeah, I think it's rock, TM rock smash. Yeah. Um, how would I get that? I'm currently trapped going to the next gym. I think you get... I think you get it from the gym leader. You should. Oh, do I have it and just not realize it? No, yeah, I don't. Have gotten it. I don't have it. You should have gotten it. Hmm. No, I don't have it. Oh, you get it. You get it from Cynthia. You have to progress the story. What's the next step in the story? I don't know. Um, <laughs> uh, hit your hit your Pokenev. Uh. It should tell you what to do. Hmm. All right. We're we're going to we're going to the Bulbapedia. This is. I think I need to go. Is this, is the next one in Lava Ridge, right? Yeah, Lava Ridge Gym. Yeah. So I need to go to Lava Ridge, but I can't head north on one eleven. Have you done any of the gyms, or is this your first one? No, we've done three gym, four this... gyms now, right? Uh, I think I think we're going to our fourth. Yes. Oh, okay. And remember, we don't want to grind too much because last time we did that, we almost over leveled. That's why I was starting to head north. I was farming, and then I realized that I should probably head north and then farm, so I don't over level. Oof. But now. I'm realizing that I can't head north at all. Um, yeah, we've defeated three gems. Um, I don't. I have no clue where to get it. And then, are there rocks in the gym? <clears throat> I'm on the stream right now. Well, if you, if I'm, when I head north. Ah, okay. <laughs> uh -huh. I just get to so this. After you, after you get the gym badge, you can use the TM. But in order to find it, uh, oh. you have to go. Uh, you have to go east from the entrance to Mauville City. Okay, so head east. I 
I think I might buy Pokemon Diamond. And then go into the house north of there and then talk to the guy at the table. Did y'all ever play Pokemon uh, Diamond? No, but I hate the new version. It looks horrendous. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> it, it looks terrible. It looks... It, you know what it looks like? It looks like a toddler tried their very hardest at 3D design for their first eight years of living and then just gave up. It, it's just so... Oh my gosh. I, it's disgusting. I didn't think it looked that bad. It's... It's... Their faces. <laughs> they're so round. <laughs> and their eyes. They just have no emotion. Zero. In battle, in like the fancy battle scenes where they're blown up into real sized people, yeah, those look fine. The Pokemon, they look great. The map itself, yeah, even that's fine. But you see like trainers and you see yourself walking and it just looks so bad. Oh my gosh. It's so gross. I hate it. Mm. Anyways, <laughs> uh, now that we've now that we have rectified that issue, uh, we will continue with our final round of Wiki What. Uh, again, method one: ignoring <clears throat> strangers in public. Step one: walk away. Step two: go a different route. And then step three since you guys did not deign to guess on the last one. Uh, don't respond to irritating behavior. When you can't just walk away, the best thing you can do is stay quiet. Staying quiet does not make you weak and does not make them the winner. Some people are annoying because they're after a reaction. Don't give them that satisfaction. In addition, not responding helps you regulate your own emotions so you won't snap on the person or someone else you meet later. And it is not something like avoiding outbursts of violence, I promise. How many words did you say? Three. How to not get angry. No. We technically have one more guess. Oh yeah. Um, how to not go into a blind fit of rage. That is like six words. That's four. I don't math. Okay. I don't math. Aren't you an IT dude? <laughs> don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> All right. Well. <laughs> oh, I should have picked one of these. <laughs> How to put a curse on someone. Oh. <laughs> How to get revenge on anyone, and it's just an image of a fist. <clears throat> How to impress a girl, it's an image of a guy moving in closer towards a woman, and she's like backing away, looking revolted. Yikes. <clears throat> um... <laughs> the image that I'm looking right now, a dude is talking, and then there, he's talking to this girl, and this girl is just eyes closed, face of peace, looking straight down. All right, guess, Daniel. Or do you want me to go on to the next step? What? I said, hmm. Uh, that is incorrect. <laughs> four. That doesn't, that doesn't count. <laughs> All right. Put next one. Okay. Step four, act like you haven't heard what was said. When a person is speaking, don't give any acknowledgement of having heard him or her. Meaning, don't even incline your head to the person or jump if he or she starts talking more loudly. Does it have a void? Yeah. No. How to ignore that's someone. Gonna, okay, that's going to count as your guys' guess. You can ask if the title has something in it. And then if I, if the answer is yes or no, it's still going to count as your guess. 
Daniel, you can still guess since that's a new rule, but uh, I still technically have two guesses. Yeah. Well, no, because you you guessed last round. You didn't. You decided not to. You said hmm. Yeah, Bro. that was your guess. I said, do you want to guess or do you want to just skip it? And you said, let's just move on. So I moved on. You could have just thrown anything out there, Daniel. You would have gotten it. Come on now. <laughs> All right, guesses. How to avoid someone. Uh, no. It doesn't have a void in it. And it's also three words. Daniel. Don't think on it so much. Just give us an answer. <laughs> That's not how this works. That's not how this works. The faster works. we go through, the, the, the more information you have. And since Will already got it wrong. Uh, how to deal with anxiety. Incorrect. All right. We're on to method two. Ignoring someone at work or school. The first method was ignoring strangers in public. Now it's ignoring someone at work or school. Uh, step one, make yourself unavailable. If you work with someone who annoys you, it may be difficult to ignore them, especially if you're on a team together. However, one way you can get out of spending time with the person is to put the blame on the work you need to get done. For instance, you could say, I'd love to chat, but I really need to finish this project. How to ignore a rival. Ooh, closer. Hmm. Ignore is in the title. Oh, we got him a chop. Yo? I didn't get anything off 111 yet, but this I got this off 112. Okay, fight. Have you killed? Have you killed stuff on 111, or did you just not? Well, I've not? I've um I've only fought trainers on 111. Ah. Please work. How much help would be so good? Yep. Oh, let's go. Okay, Daniel, you get to get the nickname from a shop. Yep. Special guest, give us our nickname. Uh, Better be good. Be creative. Daniel's ability to become to come back on the podcast is uh, on the brink here. <laughs> no, you can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> Why must you hurt me so? Why must you take forever on everything? I don't know! Jesus. My mind is nothing. This is just the day-to-day -day with Daniel right here. Basically. Just dead yeah. silence for a couple of minutes. Oh no, he hasn't He hasn't been in my office yet. He wouldn't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I went into David's office to ask him a favor, and he was just like making random noises every couple of seconds and that was it yeah that's basically how i work <coughs> um <clears throat> and then i said i'll check into it for you yep <laughs> just hmm well i mean hmm well it's because i didn't know the software policy right <laughs> <laughs> it was right. like right. Bro, right. it hey, was like my on, third man. week give them a shop and name It's a fighting type. It is a woman, it appears. Oh. Yo mama? Who? Oh. No. <laughs> Come on now. I have a name, but like, the name wouldn't be in it. Like, the name of the Pokemon wouldn't be in it, which is sad. No, it, it doesn't have to be. Our Gyarados' name is Rubber Duck. 
Oof. Because I was gonna say, get off my chop. <laughs> I think that's too long, but that's good. Mm -mm. No. Twelve character you maximum. Put, <clears throat> you just wait. Get off. Ah. Get off, get off my chop. <laughs> Tolerable. <laughs> oh wow. Tolerable. Good. <laughs> we just name it tolerable. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. Oh, it was that one's better than what I was gonna say. What were you gonna say? I was gonna say karate, karate machop. Karate kid? <laughs> no, karate machop. Karate machop. <laughs> yeah, I think get off better. I, I kind of like get off though. All right. Uh. I don't want to fight you. And guess this, gentlemen, for uh, method two, ignoring <clears throat> someone at work or school. Step one, make yourself unavailable. How to ignore response... Uh, no. How to ignore... The world? Well, what kind of inter what kind of people have we interacted with so far? Office. On this, strangers. Uh, which you have, which strangers. You have strangers and someone at work or school, but what is their uh, what have their dispositions been? You don't like them. You don't like them, but why? They're annoying. <laughs> Maybe. I don't like the long pause and then just that one word. <laughs> like, you have much to say about that. Alright, step two, report bad behavior. Whether you're being bullied or someone at work is affecting your productivity, you can and should speak out. At school, talk to an adult. At work, it's a bit more difficult, but try to address the situation with your boss, focusing on how it is affecting the work environment instead of the person's flaws. How to ignore a bully. <laughs> Incorrect. Really? How to avoid your boss. Does not include the word ignore. Oh, I thought you said I did. Yeah. Yeah, Will's answer did not include the word ignore. No, I said ignore your oh. boss. You said avoid. Oh! Step three. Don't walk around alone. If you are, are at all in fear for your safety, especially if you are being bullied, Try to keep a buddy with you. It is much harder for someone to attack or bully you if you are in a group. I don't, I don't want to fight this guy. <laughs> you don't what? I don't want to fight this guy. <laughs> uh, how to ignore your boss. Incorrect. Okay. It Oh, he's got four Pokemon. Your That's not good. Daniel. To ignore. Um... How to ignore an assailant? I don't know. Wrong. <clears throat> Alright, step four. Um... Be a bigger person. Ignoring someone who annoys you is different than bad mouthing someone who annoys you. If you want to ignore someone, then follow the maxim, out of sight, out of mind. Don't resort to calling someone names or being rude in return. When you see someone who annoys you, don't make a big deal about it. Don't talk about them in an attempt to get them to leave you alone. Just keep going about your business and don't think about that person. How to ignore annoying people. Daniel, once again, spot on, word That's for cool. word. Oh my god, I was going to say how to ignore Daniel. HR. You're bad oh. at this game. <laughs> That's cool. this Well, you got Dragon Rage? Yeah. That is bad that this whole best. time. Bad that this whole time. No, I got it, I think, at level 25. Yeah. That is, like, the best move that you could possibly have. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm out of PP for it, so yeah. Eh, he said PP. Oh, my God.
<laughs> that is the one hour mark, gentlemen. That is all I have. Daniel taking it in an absolute <laughs> landslide. Let's go. Securing his position on the podcast. <laughs> I'm gonna be kicked out. <laughs> return no. any return anytime you feel the need to, Daniel. You know, it's kind of surprising that I got the math one. <laughs> Yeah, you literally set that up for yourself, Will, and you still got it wrong. Yeah. I don't even remember what the answer was. I think it was... Oh, I, oh, I absolutely have to ask... Okay. I have to ask you this, would you rather, um, Daniel? Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Would you rather... Okay, bear with me. <laughs> would you rather... Have unlimited bacon but no games or games unli unlimited games but no games they kind of sound like you said the same exact thing in the second answer no 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 I said I said would you rather have bacon uh, unlimited bacon but no games Mm -hmm. Or games, unlimited games, and no games. <laughs> Will so we'll just trying not to Type laugh because he's already been asked this question. <laughs> Type it out because I'm I, the, the second hour answer sounds like you're saying the same thing. All right, all right, all right. I wish I could. I wish I could type it in the YouTube chat. Alright. Can you not? No. No. Uh, to read to you, chat, what I just wrote out in our uh, Discord, which is public, and you should join. Uh, I wrote, would you rather have unlimited bacon, but no games, or game, <clears throat> unlimited games, but no games? I've never been more, more confused. <laughs> <laughs> Answer the like... question. Answer the question, Daniel. Mom, come pick me up. I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, either way, you're getting no games, so unlimited bacon. Well, no, no, so. no, no. You're getting unlimited games. But no games. Yeah, but also unlimited games. This doesn't make sense. <laughs> it's a quantum state of games. What's well, hard to understand? Because it sounds like either way, you're just gameless. Like you have all the games in the world, but you don't. But you do have all the games in the world. That's the key. That's the key. Screw it. I'm just going to take the bacon. Any specific... Wait, 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 wait. Do you not want to ask any questions about the bacon? Like it could just be raw bacon. Yeah, that's what cooking is for. No, no, no. I feel, I feel you need to look into this more. You get unlimited <laughs> games. Well, th th but, but... Unlimited, but, Daniel. Unlimited. But you don't. But they're unlimited. Are we talking like... It's got a title, and you can play it, but there's no content? No, you get unlimited games. You have to have the TM strength for that one, Will. That doesn't answer the question. Also, you can catch this Pokemon. Oh, can I? Yeah, it's a new area. No, this because this is still Route 112. Oh, no mind. It would be nice to catch a fire, but no. So are we talking about like? Oh, you would you would take the bacon at the sacrifice of all games? But yeah, but you why have not take the unlimited games? 
you have the risk of getting Call of Duty every year. <laughs> like, you said no games. So you're saying unlimited Call of Duty, which has no content to begin with. <laughs> well, no, but you'd get unlimited games. Choose what you know is right, Daniel. I'm gonna take the bacon. Hmm. Put some among the bacon, Will. What? That puts him among the bacon. Uh, okay. Alright. What'd you do, Will? Will? Will would rather have unlimited games, but no games. As would I. I, I... I just, the question is, just was so random, I just went, I, bacon's not bad, but, I mean, I'd rather have video games. Of course, well, yeah. of course you would. If, if you get the, if you get the raw game, raw games. <laughs> <laughs> if you we're, get talking, the we're talking like the first copy of Doom here. <laughs> if you get... Yeah. You just get the code, you don't actually get, like, a, a disc or anything. You just get the raw code. <laughs> Can't put it into anything. Okay, I have, I have more would-you-rathers. Okay. Would you rather be hmm. dumb, ugly, oh, a no. foot shorter, or 250 pounds more than you are right now? I'm gonna add a couple of specifiers. So if when one of those say... are already true, then no, 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 no. I, I'm gonna add specifiers <laughs> so that you know exactly what's changing. So for dumb, you you literally could not do anything that requires intellect at all. Oh, so basically you're a vegetable. Okay, gotcha. No, you could do <laughs> like um, anything that requires more than a middle school education. So you could flip burgers. So what you're saying is I can be Eminem. Okay. Essentially. Um, oh no! <laughs> you, the ugly specifier, like people will physically recoil when they see you. But it does not have any effect on your intellect, height, or weight. Uh, the foot shorter has actually been specified so that you will be at the minimum height you can be before you would be diagnosed with dwarfism. So about four foot two. Um, and then I mean, when you gain those 250 pounds, you would retain the same BMI that you have currently. So if you gain the body weight, you would essentially just grow. Scale up. Oh shit, I'll take the weight then. You take the I'd weight? Be like seven, I'd be like seven, pounds? I'd be I'm like seven, I'd be like seven or eight, eight, eight foot. No, 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 you stayed the same height. You would just get wider. Oh. <laughs> oh. So for me, I would gain like 225 pounds of muscle and 25 pounds of fat, but I still would not take that. Absolutely not. I would not take 250 pounds of weight. Uh-uh. Well, then, I don't know. Fuck it. I can be four foot away. Four foot two, dog. <laughs> what? No, you said a foot, yeah, you said a foot shorter. Yeah, but then I said we specified it so that you're at the minimum height you can be before being diagnosed with dwarfism, which is four foot two. Right, and I'm five foot eleven. So, I'm so you would be four foot two. <laughs> it's not a foot shorter. It's you would be four foot two. Oh, what the f what? <clears throat> That's janky. <clears throat> That's janky. Yes, I ch I changed all of these so I could um angle your answer so to speak like i feel like you can't say a foot shorter you just would you rather have dwarfism <laughs> yeah yeah like, at this point yeah like can't just say a foot shorter and sorry, then you're uh, like oh sorry, well, let me, now let me you're a gnome a foot and nine inches shorter like oh you're a gnome now <clears throat> Uh, and when you decrease in size, you would uh, re retain your weight. So what you're saying is I'd be a hoop Okay. 
Because I think right now I'm at like 180. You would you would be a very round young man. <laughs> <laughs> oh look, there goes Circle Man. <laughs> you wear like jumpsuits and just be different colors. <laughs> <laughs> like ball pit balls. <laughs> See now, I feel like the better, the best answer would be the the middle school education. Yeah, you because that one doesn't have an yourself. effect. That one doesn't have an effect on your uh, happiness. Yeah, right. <laughs> Will picks confusion. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Will Will's choice for this answer was, I believe, <laughs> yeah, dumb. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, I have I have one more. Wait, so 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 so. Whenever you scale down your IQ, like to middle school, do you have the chance to learn stuff back? Um, no, but you can learn trades. Yeah, you, so essentially I would just be in the same boat that I would be in now. Yeah, you just can't do anything, like, academically related. So you can do, like, agriculture or machine shop, shop style stuff. Anything that can be taught via a mentor, you could do. Oh, that's fair. As opposed to a teacher. I'm ready for some Minecraft. <laughs> we have, we have, I think one or two more would you rather's, and then we'll do an outro. Yeah, okay. I I have one specific. I actually no, I wanted to do two of my own. Okay, but can I do can I do one more? Yeah. Would you rather, Daniel? Would you rather? Hello. You're cutting out. Yeah, mine mine cut out. My mic is dying. Okay, I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Hold I have up, one. Hold on, I have... hold on. Hold on. Give me a second. Should I should I get Psybeam? Uh, yeah. definitely. What should I replace yeah. with it? Um, let me look. I really only have Moonlight. That currently is not helping that much. Moonlight will be useful later game. Uh, get rid of Flash. I can't get okay. rid of HM moves. Oh, that's irritating. Um, Moonlight it is. Okay, okay. now I'm good. Um, okay. So, would you rather come up with an original and funny joke, or... Be a cat. And all that entails. Get it? Entails. Anyway. Stop. Stop. <laughs> um, I don't know. I'd probably pick the joke, to be honest. You would rather come up with one original and funny joke as opposed to uh, just being a walking joke? <laughs> That's awful. But yeah. Yeah? All of Will. my jokes are unoriginal. Get Will decided that he'd rather be a cat boy. Mom. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he heard me because he would be uh... a... <laughs> what did you say? What? I said Will decided that he would rather be a cat boy in this situation. Oh yeah. Meow. <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. 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 Alright, alright. Will has his would you rather, and then we'll do an outro. Okay. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm trying to think. Uh, okay, okay. So one one of the best ones I had was be the inventor of Among Us or had the game never exist. Never exist, 100%. <laughs> I chose, I chose inventor because then you can make the game as bad as you want. Well, yeah, but if you make it bad, you're never going to make your money. 
Well, you, you don't have to make the money. You could just send Among Us into a fiery death. <laughs> well, yeah, but if you're the like, inventor, no, 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 I no, no, would. No. Like, no, think no, no, about no. it. I could, I could add, <clears throat> I could add so much. Oh, I could have, I could have a, a Fortnite Among Us crossover. They basically imagine, actually imagine, they they did do imagine that. Just oh no! Fortnite, and then you get and then you get like pegged in the back of the head, and you turn around and you start building, and then there's just this Among Us dude walking around cranking nineties on you and just absolutely so, destroys you. That would be so funny, dude. So Fortnite actually did have an imposter mode for a little bit. I'm sure they did. Um, but I'm pretty sure they got sued because it was a direct copy, basically a direct copy of. Among us. That's hilarious. But if you were the creator, if I was a creator, I would just make the game and then wait probably about a month no, or two. You would, no, you would become, you would take over from the present. Oh. Well, never existed because you wouldn't get the money. I'm stingy. You would basically, you would basically <laughs> just... You would basically just like swap bodies with the current guy. Oh. So you would oh. have all of his assets and everything. Oh. Okay. How do I get past the Team Aqua guys? I'm really confused. Talk to them. I I did. What do they say? That that what happened to the others who went to Fall Harbor? They're late. You should probably go to Fall Harbor. Oh, yeah. God. Have you not learned fly yet? No. Yeah, I'm not going all the way up to Fall Arbor. I think that's I think that's your next option. <laughs> yeah, I, think, I think you have to. Do you, you don't even you're not even seeing what I'm seeing. <sighs> all right, well, all right. Oh, Daniel, what did, Daniel decided he would rather have the game never exist. Okay. Uh, okay. My last one. Would you rather be an Aquarius or a Cancer? A. Hey, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up, I'm on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> You're on thin ice here, buddy. What's your answer? What's your answer? I would rather be myself. Which is? I would rather be an Aquarius. All right, all right, all right. Uh, Will picked those two randomly. He does not know what either of them entails. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's just used to see if you uh, if you're like an astrology buff. I'm not, but I just know I'm an Aquarius. Acceptable. I know I'm a Taurus, but I don't know what that means. Yeah, you do seem like a Taurus. I do feel like a Taurus. <laughs> Yeah, right. you're kind of built like a Ford, but <laughs> a built like a Ford. Yeah, Ford Taurus. <clears throat> so very <laughs> badly. Oh, I wasn't gonna directly say it, but uh, shots fired. <laughs> Yikes! Oh. I, I just can't. I love, <laughs> I love the ending to our last podcast because it's just Will with his head in his hands as I'm laughing as he says he's a cowboy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised like, she so didn't Will, do so anything. Will, let me let me lock in your answer. You would rather be a cat boy than come up with an original and funny joke. And he's like, yes, that is my final answer. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, Watch our previous episodes if you hadn't, people, because they are funny. I say episodes. This is episode two. We have yeah. One. I was like, isn't this isn't this the first one or the second one? Yeah. I guess this. Te well, yeah, you should probably change this will to episode one because. Uh, oh, no. Last one was the pilot. Last one was the pilot. That's episode zero. Let's see. Oh, yeah, it's fine. Also. Also, a side note, um, is it bad that it took a lot of willpower for me not to, uh, not to buy the first hundred episodes of Spongebob today? Buy the first hundred episodes? Why? Why not? Um, get Paramount Plus and there you go. 
I'm assuming you have experience with this. Okay. Me? Would you rather <laughs> stub all of your toes every morning or oh, both geez. funny bones? I don't know. Probably all of my toes. They're really? all gonna hurt. They're all gonna hurt. Yes. The funny bones are not in the uh the the toes are first thing in the morning. And the uh, funny bones are at random points throughout the day. Ooh. And it includes and it includes all reflex points. So like knees, uh nope. ankles. Yeah, so um toes. Cuz you know exactly when it's going to happen. And you're like, "Ah shit, here we go again." <laughs> <laughs> you would seriously rather stub every single one of your toes than randomly hit your funny bone? Yeah. Funny bone doesn't hurt. Yeah, but the pins and needles, man. It hurts. I so mean, it, it so, doesn't hurt, but it hurts. So how we take out Daniel is what I'm hearing right here. The best way to take out Daniel <laughs> is to is to have his leg fall asleep. And then he's yes. done. That's it. Yes. He's gone. Oh. Yeah. Is there an issue here? <laughs> Daniel, how much do you know about Pokemon cards? Uh, not much. Not much? It okay. shows. There's a rating scale. Um, it goes from 1 to 10. It's called PSA. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, if it's rated a PSA 10, that basically means mint condition. If it's rated a 1, it means it's like almost unrecognizable, destroyed. Mm -hmm. Um. And here's the would you rather? Would you rather get a PSA one insanely rare card that should be worth like a whole bunch of money, but that's only worth fifty dollars now, or a PSA ten meh card that's worth like fifty at the PSA ten? So a card that's not very rare, worth fifty dollars, or a card that's super rare that's only worth fifty dollars because of its condition. Probably the super rare one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They're both worth the same amount of money, so. Will show the stream what I pulled yesterday. <laughs> Hello. Okay, I gotta scroll up on Discord. Gotta make sure I'm not showing anything. Uh, streamer mode is enabled. Let me switch. Uh, where's OBS? There it is. Uh, and switch over to first monitor. That's not first monitor. It... That's. Clicker, uh, clicker. <laughs> Exposed. Uh... <laughs> I think I'm currently missing like, I want to say like eight achievements from 100 percent in the game. Bro, hold up, is Cookie Clicker What are we seeing? What are we seeing? We're seeing OBS. Yes, but like, melting OBS. <laughs> yeah, basically. I'm surprised your CPU is only running at 1 right now. It should be at like 20. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. You, you pulled an Eternus VMAX. How do you, can you even zoom in on PC? Okay, Eternus I'm VMAX. Making... You and you bought got... Cookie Clicker for five dollars. It was five dollars for a game that I already had running on my like, just like I just had running in the background all the time on my browser. So I look so dead in this image. This is the day after Thanksgiving, by the way. <laughs> oh, Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do yeah, I have the cards? Hold on, I gotta go get the cards. Stream, this is me. I promise I don't usually look that depressed. Eh, that's debatable. I'm just kidding. Also, my hair is not usually blonde. Oh. <clears throat> that is confirmed. Um, please join the Discord. The link is in the description. Okay, oh, yeah, okay. We're not especially active at the moment, but as there's only four of us in it, you know, that'll change. Will has uh, returned with the uh, cards. 
<laughs> oh, and the stream's lagging. Is it? Yeah. Receiving no data, what? Uh oh. Oh, no, now it's an excellent. Is it working? Did you X out of OBS or something? No. It's not receiving it. Oh, there it is. A uh, bit of a lag there. All right, here are the uh, the cards. Where did I put them? What? Oh, they've been on my desk this entire time. He also got a Charizard. Oh yeah, I got a Charizard demon. All right, so let's see here. We got. Okay. Focus. Might be playing Cookie Clicker right now. <laughs> <laughs> you got Vicavolt V. I got Sizer V. Okay, it, the first one was a foil. This one's just a hollow. Yeah. We got a Crobat V. That one's foil? Crobat V. I could probably sell this for about 70 bucks after I get it graded. Cover up my face so you'll zoom in on. Stop zooming in on my chest. Zoom in on the freaking card. How much does it cost to get graded? Uh, like twenty bucks, less. Depends on how far away they are. It also depends on how many cards you send them. Which I still I need to send. Oh, I still have. I have the really good one up there. Okay, so wait. Oh, I'm doing okay. Uh, got. Was it focus? Lizapede or Slizz or something? Scorch V Max. Yeah. A nut, a size of V Max full art. And then the other one was just a V. Yeah, yeah. and then size of V full art and the best one. Eternus V Max it. Rainbow. I pulled that one. Which that one's about seventy as well. Yeah. There's a couple of. I, I think I might just. Put... I hope I hope I hope I get the legendary class when we open ours. <laughs> if I get zero, I'm gonna be mad. That's how I'm feeling. I'm like, if I get nothing, I'm gonna be sad, dude. And that's sitting up there with my Snorlax V Max Rainbow that I got. That's worth about now only about three hundred. Well, it's worth four hundred at the time. I have a uh, I have on the way a Secret Art um what's it called Zekrom Hollow Foil, which is about ninety at near mint condition, so about eight and a half. I think mine might be higher. But I'm estimating on the low end, which is eight and a half. Anyways, we're about at our time, gentlemen. Let me just defeat this Wingle, even though it's apparently really hard. Wingle is about to beat you, bro. My God! It used a freaking potion or something. I, I don't think it used rest. God. Or roost, probably. Whoa, wing attack. Jesus. About to lose worm here. <laughs> you mean worm too? Yeah. We already we lost, lost worm. worm. We actually did lose worm, yeah. Yeah. We have commands on our server that show you what exact. <laughs> yeah, if you type in slash command, it tells you all the commands we have. Okay, Dragon Rage it is. Yep. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, just liquidizing anything. This is why Gyarados is just goaded. Oh, I'm fighting a trainer. I've already forgotten. Bye bye.
Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm done wasting time. Yeah, just I'm, do it. Just yeah, do it. Yeah. Delete him. Goodbye. Oh my god. Oh, it's survived. Yeah. Don't paralyze me. Oh. It just lowers our speed. Mega Drain! Uh oh. Did 8 health to oh, me? Ah, oh, okay, whatever. It's not that bad. Gonna keep using tackle. There we go. Is he level 28 already? Yeah, no. looks like it. No. No. Oh, just sure. Alright. Oh, okay. That's a good one. I'm gonna save here. And see y'all next time. Thanks for some hundred subscribers. We'll get you that special next week. Looking forward to it. Same see y'all next week. Uh, we will be doing this weekly, and we will have yeah. a uh, special guest, I believe. Not Daniel, but another one. And Daniel should be back. Yeah. Thanks everyone for watching, and have a good day. See ya. Peace out.